in today's video, I get fought over by a rich and poor family on who's going to adopt me. Make sure to hit that like button to show some love to little orphan Sam. And if you subscribe in the next two seconds, you can become a rad tad. Oh, another day in the adoption center. I wonder if today is gonna be the big day where I get adopted. Oh, I've been waiting for this day for ages. Let's see. It looks like two people are already in the parking lot. Maybe, maybe today will be my lucky, lucky day. Hi there, ma'am. I'm Sam. I'm one of the orphans here for adoption. Why, hello there. What a fashionable young child. Oh, yeah, of course. Oh, hi there. What a cool kid. Oh, well, thanks for all these lovely compliments. Would either of you two want to adopt me? Oh, actually, how would you like to come home with me? <gasps> really? Come home and be adopted by you? But I want to adopt her. Oh, well, you seem really nice as well. Oh, goodness. How on earth am I gonna decide? Why would she want to live with someone as grubby as you? <gasps> hey, now. Literally, you're covered in grossness. Hey, that's rude. Okay, well, I don't want you guys to argue anymore, so I think I've come up with a plan. Why don't I spend one day with you, rich mom, and the next day I'll spend with you, poor dad. And then on day three, I'll be able to decide who I want to adopt me. Okay, I can agree to that. Oh, oh, amazing. What about you? That sounds like a good idea, as long as I get to have you first. Yeah, that sounds good to me. I can go home with you first, which means I'll see you tomorrow, poor dad. I'll see you tomorrow, Sam. All right, mom. Well, let's go ahead and get in your nice luxury car and head to my new home for the night. Yeah, come along, Sam. Let's head home. Oh, man. I'm so excited to see all of the cool things that my new rich mom can have. <gasps> wow! Look at this beautiful, beautiful estate. Wow, you are really, really rich. This is amazing. All right, let's go ahead and take a look inside. <gasps> wow! This place is so, so nice, Mom. How on earth did you get something so nice? Oh, well, do you like it, Sam? Like it? I love it! Now, I have some gifts for you, my new daughter. <gasps> wow, really? Already some gifts? Your very own tablet. <gasps> A tablet? Wow, I've always wanted one of these. I can go ahead and watch all these YouTube videos and subscribe to the Sam Brookhaven channel. How did you know this is exactly what I wanted? And I've got you this awesome new phone so we can keep in contact. <gasps> wow, and a brand new phone too. Wow, this is amazing, Rich Mom. How on earth are you able to afford all of this? I've been climbing my way up the ladder for decades. I work so, so hard, Sam. Wow, that's so inspiring, Rich Mom. Well, I would hate to keep you from your work. Do you have something you need to do right now? Yes, I do, actually. That's why I got you these new gifts. You can keep yourself entertained while I'm at work. Oh, okay, Mom. That sounds good. Well, it looks like she's gonna go ahead and go find somewhere to work. But that's okay. I've got my uh, tablet to keep me busy. Oh, that's the garage. And I can just go ahead and show myself around. <gasps> like, look at this bedroom. And it has a view out to a pond with chairs and a bathroom, a private bathroom. Wow, this rich mom really could give me everything that I want. But if I'm being honest, I think the thing I want most is her attention. Maybe I can go see if she needs anything. Hey, uh, rich mom, do you by chance need a, a water or anything? I'm a little busy at the moment, Sam. Oh, uh, right, right, don't mind me. I just wanted to take a look uh, upstairs. You know, uh, maybe with uh, these rooms. Wow, these are really, really cool too. Maybe I guess I'm gonna leave her alone. Wow, this is really nice and everything, I think maybe I'm just gonna relax for a little bit, you know? Let my mom do what she needs to do, and I'm sure she'll be done any moment now. Oh, man, wait, what's that noise? What is the meaning of this? Are you kidding me? We could lose a client! Oh, oh no, it looks like my mom's actually really worried about something. I should try and comfort her. Hey, hey mom, good morning! Just uh, stay there. I'll be there shortly. Oh no, 
know. Um, is everything okay, Mom? You sound really stressed out. Sam, some technical error just happened at work. They really, really need me. I know we haven't been able to spend time together, but I have to go. Wait, you, you have to go? But what about us having breakfast together? I fell asleep on the couch and we didn't get to spend any time. I'm sorry, but they need me. There's a five-star breakfast in the fridge. Now, I've got to go and I'm sure you'll pick me on the last day. I'll see you later, Sam. What? But, but Rich Mom, I... Oh, I barely got to spend any time to get to know her. Oh, and now I guess I have to eat my breakfast alone and walk to go find poor dad for his chance today. And I was really hoping this would go a lot better, but oh well. I'll just go ahead and take this waffle and maybe this is just a sign. Maybe, maybe I'm supposed to be with the poor dad. Maybe he is destined to be my father. It's time to go see. All right, and that is the end of my waffle. I didn't get to eat as much as I wanted to, but it's okay. I'm so excited to see the man who could maybe be my dad. Knock, knock, coming in. Hi, wow, look at this place. Sam, welcome to my room. Yeah, well, it's uh, it's pretty tidy. There isn't much space, but it's home. Yeah, it looks like you've only got one bed, one bathroom, and a TV and a computer. So, I mean, this is perfect for just you, but I was hoping we could do something fun together today. Do you maybe want to play outside together? Sure, playing outside sounds perfect. <gasps> Yay! Okay, I'm so happy that you want to spend time with me. So, now that we're out here in this uh, parking lot. What do you want to play? Let's play dodgeball. Dodgeball? That sounds so fun. Okay, Dad. Do you have some balls we can play with? <gasps> Perfect. Owen thinks you gave me one too. All right. Are you ready, Dad? Yep, I'm ready. All right. And yeah. <gasps> oh, goodness. Okay. Almost got gotcha. you. Oh, so close, Sam. Whoa, yeah, that's right. I'm the best at dodging. You won't be able to get me. <laughs> Rah! <laughs> Looks like I got you, Dad. I got you. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, well, looks like my stomach's grumbling. Maybe I didn't have enough breakfast like I should have. I'm getting kind of hungry. Do you have any snacks that I could eat? You're hungry? Well, I'm out of food, but I know a way we can get you some. Okay, out of food, that's really unfortunate, but I'm sure if we work together, we can get plenty more. If we beg for money or leftovers outside the diner, I'm sure we'll get some. We beg for money and leftovers? I don't know, that sounds a little, uh, not that great. Yeah, but we can get you food in no time. Come on, I'll show you. Okay, Dad. It if you say so. I mean, come on, who could say no to a cute kid like you? I guess that's true. Okay, Dad, well, let's make our way over to the diner and, and let's hope that someone has some compassion for us. Anything helps, extra cash, leftovers. Uh, my dad and I need a meal. Is this how you do it, Dad? Yep. Good job, Sam. You're doing so well. Oh, thanks, Dad. But I can't help but feel a little bit embarrassed. But, I mean, if this is how we are going to get by, then I'll help you. Yeah, anything helps. We'll take anything. Oh, wait. Is that? I think that's Rich Mom. Oh, my goodness. Sam? Oh, hi, Rich Mom. Uh, do you have any spare change or leftovers for me? What have you done to her? Wait, done to me? Uh, nothing's been done to me. You're begging outside of a diner, Sam. This is beneath you. Oh, no, come on. I don't want any trouble for me or Sam. Yeah, look, he doesn't have tons and tons of money like you do. I'm just trying to get Sam a good meal. You are the trouble here, sir. Come on, Sam. Let's get you home where you're safe and sound and fed. Well, but then that would be breaking the competition. Yeah, it's my day with Sam. I don't know if I can just back out on this now, Rich Mom. I think I really have to see it through and stay. Fine, but you know who's won already just by this. Oh, well, oh, Rich Mom, I... Oh, man, I'm so sorry. Um, maybe, Dad, if I pick you, I didn't expect her to be so, so mean. That's okay. Thanks for staying, Sam. You didn't have to. Well, of course. I really want to make sure I see this competition through till the end, fair and square. It doesn't matter to me how much money you do or don't have. Okay, Sam, you're the best. Well, 
Uh, look, we got a little bit of change from earlier, so why don't we go and get some ramen? I know it's not the best meal, but it'll do for now. Come on, we can go heat it up in the microwave. Okay, day three is here, which means it's time to make my decision. After spending a full day with you, rich mom, and a full day with you, poor dad, I think that I've come to a decision. I'm going to be adopted by... Neither of you! I'm sorry, what? Yeah, what do you mean, Sam? Well, you see, Rich Mom, you are great at gifts and you have a beautiful home, but you need to make sure that you have enough time to spend with your kid. I was so lonely. And poor Dad, you're so kind and understanding and you love to play, but you need to be able to have a home if you want to have a proper family. So that leaves me with the conclusion of being adopted by neither of you. Oh, well, that doesn't sound very fair at all. Well, I don't know what to tell you. If you were able to spend more time with me and get to know me, maybe I would have chosen you. Yeah, Sam, I thought you understood me and my struggles. Well, I do understand you, but I don't think that you're ready for a family yet. Whatever. I've got somewhere to be now and not waste any more of my time. Oh, well, I didn't think it was a waste of time. Yeah, I guess I'll leave too. It was nice knowing you, Sam. See you never. Oh, well, I'll see you. Man, looks like they actually really did want to adopt me. But I know that I made the right choice. This might be the third time I'm going back to the adoption center, but I know that next time I'll find my forever home.